Hi everybody, I hope you're having a great day. In this video, I'm going to be covering Mind Spinner. He made his first appearance in Miles Morales, Spider-Man, issue number 25, that was released in April of 2021. He's a human mutate clone of Miles Morales, and he does not have a listed height or weight, although he is notably taller than typical Miles Morales, who stands five foot eight, and he's also slimmer, while having the unique trait of four extra arms that come out of his back, giving him eight appendages just like a spider, not to mention three sets of red eyes. Now, beyond Mind Spinner's terrifying looks, he seems to have all the abilities of Miles Morales' Spider-Man, except for the Venom Blast, although this is replaced by a powerful psionic burst that he can direct at individuals, which gives them intense pain. Overall, Mind Spinner has low-level, moderate superhuman strength, durability, and speed, while having vast superhuman agility and reflexes, which he uses in combination with his extra spider legs to give him a leg up in combat. The only characteristic of Mind Spinner's abilities that may seem to be a weakness is that individuals can build up a tolerance for his psionic blasts. Now, just like the other spider clones, Mind Spinner was one of three individuals created by the AI known as Assessor. This villainous intelligence had captured Miles Morales to study his genetics and abilities, later making three clones out of this genetic material, which included Shift, Salem, and Mind Spinner. Now, Mind Spinner doesn't speak very much and is somewhat of an introvert. He only began to be more extroverted after the torturous ordeals that he and his brother went through from the Assessor to try to mold them into the perfect weapons. This fact would lead to he and his brothers escaping, although they would have to figure out a way to stay alive, since as clones, they weren't designed to live on their own, ultimately leading them to taking a scientist and putting him in an abandoned warehouse to force him to make them a cure. Mind Spinner would first encounter Miles Morales and Spider-Man Peter Parker when he and Salem went to rescue their brother Shift after he got into a fight with the two heroes. In this encounter, Mind Spinner was key in leaving Miles and Peter unconscious as he and his brothers escaped. But of course, Miles didn't leave these three clones alone and would track down their warehouse, destroying the compound that was being created to cure their condition. It goes without saying that this immeasurably angered the three brothers, with them beating Miles nearly to death and webbing him up. And although Miles acknowledged that he didn't really know what the compound was and that he made a mistake, Mind Spinner and Salem didn't believe that Miles would truly help them. And the two would leave with Salem telling Miles that they were going to go take out his mother, leaving Shift to guard him. However, only Mind Spinner would be tasked with going to Brooklyn University Hospital to try to take out Miles' mom. This was just a diversion, while Salem would actually go to get Miles' baby sister named Billy Morales. And lucky for Miss Morales, Shift would actually release Miles just in time for him to get there to stop Mind Spinner from hurting his mother. The two would once again do battle, but in this occasion, Miles was already adapted to the psionic blast that Mind Spinner gave, which left them with nothing but hand-to-hand -hand combat, this time Miles coming out on top by using his Venom Blast. We'd later see Mind Spinner at the Brooklyn Bridge, in a scenario set up by Salem to force Miles to fight him. Miles was actually winning the battle against Salem, but before he could solidify his victory, Mind Spinner would show up and weaken Miles with another psionic attack, which left Salem just enough time to take the leverage of Miles' little sister and threaten to drop her from the bridge. But when little Billy was rescued by Shift, who had had a change of heart and was on Miles' side, Salem prepared to take Shift out for his betrayal. But the prospect of losing Shift was too much for Mind Spinner, who stopped and fought Salem. This epic battle on the Brooklyn Bridge would result in an explosion due to Salem's Venom Blast that would take out Salem himself and Mind Spinner. Now, for his powers and abilities and his influence on the Marvel Universe, for my 1 to 10 rating, I'll give Mind Spinner a rating of 6, which is an expert rating. I hope everyone enjoyed this video. I'll talk to you next time. Be sure to like, subscribe, and join the new sage.